Hey YouTube, it's Amethyst Rawls. And I'm Ty Rawls. And together we're the Rawlses. Today is a special day because yes. we have reached 100 subscribers. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> okay, so emojis, yeah, we're this happy. We're this happy. Okay. So since we um, reached 100 subscribers, we thought it would be amazing to have some kind of new food challenge and with a new punishment at the end of this video. Yes. And the punishment is going to be a pie in the face. Ah. Literally. So we had a pie of just, it just whipped cream. And we tried to write uh, the number 100 on it using like strawberry syrup. <laughs> And it, it didn't come out. It did not come it out. It didn't come out the way we wanted to. So it just looked like. A uh, dessert. Yeah. It just looked like <laughs> with, with, whipped cream with syrup on it. Yeah. And so we tried to write 100. Didn't work. But that's okay. And uh, our food challenge that we're going to do today. We have the food off to the side. We have six food items. And each of the six food items we bought three Different, different brands. Yeah, three different, different brands. brands. And we shopped at Walmart, shopped at Aldi, shopped at uh, Publix. Publix and Which are all good grocery stores depending on your budget and everything. So we wanted to see if they taste the same or if they're different. Yeah, Can so you really tell? Are you really paying for the name or the actual quality of the food? Yeah, so what we're trying to do is guess... The name brand, the basically the brands people are more familiar with, and see if we can guess it or see which one tastes better. So, um, yeah. What do you think? And the way we're gonna do it, we're gonna have we have a uh, we're gonna have the three food items sat on the table. We're gonna taste each food item, and we're gonna set our little voting tree thing right by the item that we think is the name brand the name brand item yep and uh like i said six food items so the most you can get is six points and so I, we're gonna see who is gonna be a loser i already lost the last time i lost the shrimp challenge i am not losing the guess the name brand challenge we'll see i'm not, I'm not gonna lose this one, we'll so. see we'll see and again, the loser will have to get a pie in the face to celebrate us having 100 subscribers. So every time we reach a milestone, we're going to up the ante with the punishment. So please, please share with your friends and family. Get more subscribers onto our, our team, our, our channel, so that way you can see more punishment. Yes. So, yeah. <laughs> do that <laughs> okay so we're gonna start with the whipped cream our first food item that we're gonna try from the three different brands is whipped cream you know something that you can have on top of your dessert or other things you know <laughs> but uh we're gonna try that wink wink <laughs> so yeah I mean, I'm, I'm just going which one you want to try first let's try the middle all right, let's try the middle one first. Okay, it's sweet. It's, yeah. Kind of. It's been a while since real. I had whipped cream, so. It, it was set, setting out for a while. I don't know. It, it's okay. Let's try this one. What we didn't say is that we, uh, when we, um, We did a process of mixing these up to where we don't know what is what. So we are giving our honest opinion, not based on name brand. Oh, there's an aftertaste in that one. <laughs> it's oily. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that is oily. It is a little bit sweeter, too. Okay, let's try this one. Yeah, these are mixed up. We don't know what is what. This right here, visually. What in the world? <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and do a quick vote. Um, this was the best yeah, tasting I, one. I agree. Um, yeah, I need space. 
I'm gonna agree. Yeah. Um. The the middle one tastes the best. Yeah. Uh, and I. I'm not sure if it's a name brand or not. Uh, but uh, this one right here, I'm gonna tell you right now, that's the worst. This is nasty. And this one over here, it's okay. It's, it's, it's yeah. But it has like a oily aftertaste. aftertaste. It's yeah. like a weird oily aftertaste. So this one, the consistency was really good and sweet. Not many complaints on that one. Yeah. So you you want you want to see if we guessed it right? Yeah. Is that ready whip? Yeah, it's ready. Whip. <laughs> <laughs> we got you know, it right. <laughs> even though I am competing against him. We both got it right. Oh, so. yeah. Oh, so, yeah. So, I guess our tastes are kind of bougie. <laughs> so, we both got one point. Ding, ding, ding. Let's see what this one was. Publix. Publix. Okay, y'all. So, if you shop at Publix on a regular, don't buy the whipped cream. No go. So, this gives us great value. And great value is not, it's, it, it's not, not bad. that bad. Not bad. If it's you're trying to save a little bad. bit of money, but you still want some flavor... Yeah. yeah, Walmart. It seems like it's a good choice. Yeah, it's it's, it's, know, it's a great Walmart value. Walmart brands, are, you know, it's a great value. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so the next item we have is peanut butter. A good staple, you know, when you are down on the money and you waiting on your next paycheck, peanut butter always has your back. Yeah. So we got three different brands, and I I I can't even remember the brands. Um, Jif. Um, great value in Publix, yeah. right? Jif, great value in Publix. So, um, last time we started in the middle, so let's start from my side. And all right. Look, I'm telling you this. And they're all creamy. They're all the same. Yeah, they're all, all the same type. I mean, same mix. There's is no nuts, like crunchy. They're all creamy. Um, but I, what I was saying is, I gotta win this challenge, man. So. Maybe I'm gonna keep my stuff to myself. I'm not gonna say anything. <laughs> I'm gonna be quiet. I don't want to say. I don't want to speak out loud my strategy. So I'm gonna taste this. And oh, then, you gonna be slick with it, baby? Yep, I'm gonna okay. taste it. I like peanut butter, so especially when you have bananas. Yes. Tastes like peanut butter. That's good. Yeah, it's good. Tastes like peanut butter. Now let's try this middle one right here. This one looks a little bit lighter. Less sweet. Yeah. It's less sweet. It's like roasted. Roasted. Mm. Man, our taste is so. Man, if we tie. Okay, I'm gonna try this one. I don't want. Oh. Let me move this one. Hmm. Well, early vote. You know what? I was gonna do the same thing, but I don't want to tie. I'm gonna say. So you think that's Jeff? I think it's Jif. All right, the vote is locked in. I Mine think is like slanted. I I think um, I'm gonna tell you this, man. I'm gonna speak out loud. I really think this one is Jif. But but I don't know. This one this one is like a little bit too sweet. Like they're trying to overcompensate, and this one is like less sweet, and this one is not not sweet at, not that much sweet at all. So it's like too sweet, medium. This that one. that one's is like straight roasted, roasted peanut butter. Like, but anyway, yeah. Let's see. Oh, I'm gonna look at yours. Where? That's gonna be the turning factor right there. Let's, get Let's see. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh no! See, I told you that was trying to overcompensate. Publix. Publix oh. is good. Okay. It, I'm telling hey, you, people that shop at Publix, that peanut butter is good. I'm going to tell you. I like that peanut butter. I'm not going to lie. The, the the Publix one is a little bit too sweet. It's it's a little bit too sweet. It's it's good, though. Now, I know I ki love ki it. kids will love it. Great, this great value one. Kids. 
I said kids will love it. But I like that one. Okay. But kids will love it because it's sweet. Why? It don't have to be kids. It can just be somebody that likes peanut butter and the sweet. But kids love sweets. But Not anyway. All of them. Yeah, most of them. Anyways, anyway. Stop. Great value. I'm, te- I'm trying to tell you. Y'all need to put some kind of sweetener in there because that's just, it's like burnt peanuts that were mixed together with the oil and salt and called it peanut butter. Where's the sugar? Where's it's, the honey? It's something. It's not that good, but I guess if you um, don't want that much sugar and that not that much flavor, just get some great Go value. Go to Walmart and get the great value right there. But the GIF is good. It's, it's in the middle. It's good. It's good. So, uh, two points. Two, one, yeah. Let's go. So, our third item is potato chips. Okay? Um, They're all the ridges, ruffle type. Yeah. And um, I mean, who doesn't like potato chips? Yeah, and I... I mean, potatoes and salt. Fry that. That's a good snack, you know? Mm-hmm. When you're watching Netflix or, you know, just on lunch, you know, you... Snack on chips. So we decided the three brands are Ruffles and I think Publix. Publix again. And great value. And great value again. Okay. So um I'm hungry, man, because she she got she, she got off work. She hungry. I'm hungry. I haven't really eaten anything today. Okay, so and, right here. Okay. I don't know. Maybe, maybe we should. I'm trying to see. Maybe I should not even. Like the ridges on these? Mm-hmm. Not bad. You need no. more salt. Um, it's not that bad. I don't want to get, eat too much because then you're going to see the label at the bottom. I oh, know. So I'm going to try this one. Ridges on the potato chip there. Let me try this one. That doesn't have much salt either. This tastes a little weird. And here's the. This one tastes a little weird. There. Visually, they um, they look the same. Yeah. Except the ridges on this one is look like smaller, smaller ridges. Yeah. I'm hungry, so. You know what? They all taste the same, man. That one does. That one doesn't have as much salt as that one. I really don't know. I'm just gonna guess. Yeah, I don't know either. I don't know. Early voting again. Hopefully, it pays off. Hopefully. I'm gonna say the way this one looks. The ridges are small. I don't think ruffles would do that. Those are like ripples. Yeah, these are. Even... That should be a good off-brand <laughs> potato chips ripples. Let me try this one more time. Would y'all buy uh, a brand called Ripples? Let me try this like, one more time. I'm a, I'm gonna agree with you. Move that, move that A over. I'm gonna agree with you. Oh, yeah. that, you copying me, or are you actually nope. thinking I'm right? No, nope. yeah, I'm thinking I'm right. This I'm going with my taste. I'm the one right. who got the last one right. Jif, you know what I'm saying? Okay. I think it's this but, one. But the Publix brand of peanut butter was. It was good. It tastes better, but it won't Jif. Okay. <laughs> I guess people that like Jif, they pay more money. Yeah, and it's for good. The name because Publix is better. No, I'm just saying. All right. So, Jeff is better because it gave me a point. <laughs> Thank you, Jeff. <laughs> All right, so the reveal is this Ruffles. What? Great. What the heck? Yo. It's this one. Nope, that's Publix. This is Publix. The Ripples. This is Ripples. For Pub- what the heck? And I was going to go with that, too. 
So I this should... is this one is the ruffle. This one. I was gonna go with that. I was gonna go with that. The, that the ridges are too small. I was definitely about to go with this one, but this one does taste better. It it it, it Publix? tastes. That's not Publix. Is it? It's great oh, value. Great value. My bad. Great value tastes. Uh, it's in the running with uh ruffles, man. So it's it's actually better since we voted for it. You know. Not we really. We, no, according we, to our taste buds, it is. But but we, but we thought that would be the ruffles because you know name brands usually taste the best. That's why they're name brands. Yeah. So obviously, it's not working because uh, great values taste just as pretty good. Yeah. Our fourth food item is surreal. Surreal. Cheerios. Honey nut Cheerios. You know, that's good for the heart, they say. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Low cholesterol, mm-hmm. they say. Mm-hmm. So. Well, well, all of them not called Honey Nut Cheerios. Some of them called Honey Nut O's or just O's. I don't, I don't know. I just know one of them from Publix. One is Honey Nut Cheerios, the real brand. And then we got uh, Great Value, right? Yeah. Yeah, Great Value again. So. I'm just going to tell you off of visual, visually, this one right here looks very, <laughs> sh- this one looks like it got honey on it, visually, and this one too, this looks dry, this cereal just look like, that must be great value, it looks like, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, it just look like O's, this is, don't call it honey nut anything, O's, but off appearance, I'm gonna say just off appearance. I haven't tasted it. All right, it yet. early voting. That's my vote. You didn't even taste it yet. I know. You know how. But it's in my. But it's spades, But it's can... in my way. I need to. I need to. I need to. Eat okay, it. well, this is my vote. Okay. Okay. You know how in spades when you're down, <laughs> you uh, what do you call it? Go uh, blind. Go blind. I'm going blind right now, even though I see. But so you're I, not gonna eat any? Nah. That's Honey Nut Cheerios. Okay. I'm going blind. So it's... I'm remixing right now. So you, without tasting, you just... that's Honey Nut Cheerios. Okay. I'm going blind right now. Is it gonna give you two points? Oh, you know, that's a new rule right there. You trying to add in? You can't do it. Should have said in the beginning. No, I mean, I mean but... just give me one point so that I mean I'm fine with that. Just to. That's pretty good though. I kind of want to taste it. Too. Taste it. Okay. Ooh, I'm spitting. I told you to taste it. Ooh. What you mean? <laughs> 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 it's good. Ooh. I'm just not a fan of Cheerios, so. Yeah, that's Honey Nut Cheerios. I'm not a fan of Cheerios, I'm sorry. What's the score right now? 2 1, right? Two one, yeah, that got that definitely got to be honey Cheerios, man. There's other stuff. Uh, let me try this one. One more time. Yeah, I'm, this off the look. That one don't taste that bad though. They all After taste a good. While, I'm just gonna be snacking. They all they all taste good to me. This is an excuse for me to snack. Evidently, we I'm, we hungry. Mm-hmm. But yeah, this this right here, I think is honey nut. This right here, I think it's honey nut Cheerios. I already know it is. And I'm going blind. Like I said, said from the beginning, visually it looks it looks better than the other two cereals. Um, so this is my vote. Ready to? Yeah, what if it's like great value or something? Yeah, honey nut Cheerios. <laughs> Hey. It's tied now. Uh, no, it's not tied. I got a point too. I got three. I thought. You thought what? I got three. You got two. Bruh. <laughs> what, what you thought? I thought. Nothing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm winning. I'm going to win this time. I ain't no losing, dog. Okay. 
<laughs> okay, we are down to our last two food items. Yes, we have some green, green beans. beans. They are uncooked. They just straight out the, the can. can. Mm-hmm. Straight so. out the can. No salt, no pepper, no no, no lar- butter, no hot sauce. No lorries. Just straight no garlic. Straight out the can. So uh garlic. Let's let's go. I mean, visually, these are these are these are like they discolor. They're all different colors and they're skinnier. These are cut straight. These are yeah, yeah, these are uh, a little fatter. Seem mm-hmm. like they got more fatter ones in it. And they look like they cut even. They cut it's like it looks better. Yeah. And uh yeah, I don't know. This one just looks medium. I don't know. It is a meh. But I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go strictly off flavor and figure out what tastes better. If there's a difference in flavor. Yeah, if there's a difference, and I'm gonna try this one. I'm gonna first. try this one. Hmm. Don't know. Mm. Yeah, that one tastes a little watery. Let me try this one over here. Real talk, they all taste the same. So the three brands are Green Giant. Great Pub- value in, in public. In public, okay. Yeah, um, I really don't know. I'm gonna say that's Green Giant. I'm gonna say this is Green Giant. Oh my goodness, there is a difference again. I'm gonna say this is Green Giant. <laughs> that one's kind of watery, so I think this is Green Giant. I think this one is Green Giant. This is going to determine if it's going to be a tie or a tie just going to really beat me. <laughs> it's going to be a tie because tie going to win. Not a tie and score, but tie, it's going to be tie that gets this. Watch. Okay. Green Giant! <laughs> My taste buds on point, baby! Oh my- my taste buds on point, dog. My taste buds on point. I told you that one was watery. That one. It was, it was. <laughs> Publix. I, I like me some Great Publix then. Yeah. <laughs> no, but for real though, like I have to show this. They're cut so cute they and are, perfect. Honestly, like, look yeah. at that. Visually, this one, um, it looks better. It looks better, and I and, 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 and I gotta the go green with my giant. I mean, it was too fibrous. I was I was still chewing. Yeah, it was, it was. But I gotta go with my first instinct, and my first instinct was this. And as soon as I tasted oh, that, I was like, "That's watery." Last time I didn't go against with my first instinct, I got it wrong. Wrong. I'm mad at that. Like I I thought this was green giant. No, green giant right here, baby. So what's that right there? What I got? Four. Not four, but four. Let's go. What in the world? What? Well, I mean, it's already determined. I'm about to have a pie to say. <laughs> Unless... How many points you got? One? I got two. Oh, okay. Last item. We have smoked oysters. Yes. My favorite. I... I love seafood. I love oysters. Um, I actually like them raw. But when I introduced my beautiful wife to raw oysters. I know. With the lemon juice and the pas- t- Tabasco. Tabasco, not Tabasco. <laughs> <laughs> so I put her on to raw oysters and she loved them. And I love them too. They're, They're really good. good. They're really so, good. Uh, 
This will be a good um, gateway to get into oysters. Mm-hmm. Try it smoked first. Yes. Or oyster Rockefeller, you know, at a restaurant. You bake, order those. They bake it. Yeah, they bake it. I highly recommend that stuff. So, mm-hmm. yeah. I so, we're going to have smoked oysters. And the brand we have is. Um, the name brand is Chicken, Chicken of the of, Sea. Chicken of the Sea. And. Um, Great value. Great value. And then we got one from Aldi. Aldi. So, Don't sleep in that place either. So that's the only this all it's the only spot we can find, you know, oysters. Publix the Publix didn't have it. It didn't have smoke oil. Okay, due to Hurricane Dorian, it was gone. Yeah. Yeah. So Aldi had it. Yeah. <laughs> Shout out to Aldi. Clutch. Okay, so, yeah, I'm just going to try, you know. Before I try anything, visually, they, these the look, they, they look the same. These look bigger. Okay. Uh, over here to this side, those look bigger. That's what I was going to try first. Um, I don't know. I don't, I don't even know if they were the same as far as, like, size, ounces, or whatever. But this is like it got more oysters. I don't know. Um. Those look bigger though. Okay. Let me let me try these try these right here. I, I guess all of them are in some type of oil. Hmm. Gotta find chicken of the sea. Let's see. That's good. Thing is, I'm, I'm maybe I'm just biased because I just love oysters so. Can't tell the difference. Oh, oh freaking fruit fly here. Let me try this one. I like this. I don't even know if this is uh, chicken of the sea. I don't know. Mm. But I like this one the most. The, the flavor Yo. is a bomb. I like this one. Yo, that one is good. It this one is really. You know what? It don't even matter what I pick. Either, <laughs> it don't matter because either way, won. either way, you I already won. won. So okay. I mean, should I just style on it real quick and just you know? Yeah, that one tastes the best. It does, but hey, <laughs> don't take my word. Like this is name no, brand. No, I mean, it could be Publix. All I know. It tastes the best. So I'm gonna go with that one. Okay. So I think it tastes the best. I think that's chicken of the sea. Again. Those came, oysters are chicken of the sea. Go ahead. Again, if you have come this far in this video, you know that I'm already the loser. And uh, I'm getting the pie in the face. And this is in celebration of having 100 subscribers. But, uh... Now we're down to this last one, so we can see if Ty gets one extra point or not. Okay. I got it. Dog. Um, That's chicken of the sea. It gotta be. As far as smoked oysters go, is this chicken of the sea? It tastes better, so I don't know. What's that? Oh, this is great value, dog. Yo, really? This is great value. Yo. That's crazy. Oh my God. Aldi. Chicken of the sea. That's the. Oh. Aldi has. I mean, not Aldi, but um, Great Value has That's very really good. good oysters, it's really good. dog. It's really if good. If you like smoked oysters, get the Great Value. They bigger and they taste better. Let me get some more of that. Oh, it's not as pungent. Let me get some and more. Potent. The oil that is in, it's good. I like it. It's really good. But um, yeah. Evidently, I go for quality over name brand, and um, I've been wrong this whole entire time. So um, I really, I really did not think that was chicken of the sea, dog. I really did not think that was chicken of the sea. I I thought that one was. That one tastes better. This, this one tastes 
You got a weird taste to it. This one was okay. What? Yep. All right, so. I'm the winner, baby. Finally! I win! Okay, so, you know, just in case I prepared that, you know, I was gonna lose, I got this, uh, rain poncho. Because, <laughs> um, I feel like Ty will go OD. So, um, we gotta figure out how. So, as you can see, I am the winner, I am the champion. I have four points to Amethyst losing. I think she got two. I don't know. I, I, I win. Okay. So now she is going to endure the punishment. And she knew she was going to endure punishment because that's why she bought a poncho. Just in case, you know, I got a rain poncho because I know he will probably go OD just to rub it in my face that he finally wants something. <laughs> So, as a person that can take an L, I know I lost. Go ahead and put on this poncho. See, I can take an L too. You know, I the last. Does this count? No. <laughs> <laughs> the last last challenge I lost. I had to eat a habanero. I ate it like a champ. <laughs> you better get this pie in the face. I got my lashes on. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. It's gonna be a mess. Okay. It's it's shaking and everything. Look at this. Look at this pie. Oh my god. I don't want to get on the microphone. But uh sorry baby, your makeup is gonna be all messed up. Oh poor baby. <laughs> poor baby. <laughs> no, wait, 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 wow. come, 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 come here, come here. <laughs> I'm gonna count of three, okay? One <laughs> guys for tuning in <laughs> make sure you like comment share and subscribe to our channel and hit the notification <laughs> bell oh my god thank you guys i can't see <laughs> deuces bye i can't see i think it's in your hair oh my god it's all on the walls on the carpet that's fine Your eyelash. What you gonna do with this eyelash? Clean it. It's mink. Oh, okay. Baby, you wanna kiss me? Nope. Dang. I'm good. Help me. <laughs> Help you. Help me. I can't see. Use a uh, spatial memory. Oh, it's cold. Oh, it's cold. What you doing? Go this way.